Welcome back to Montana this morning. The time now is 627. Joining us from By Talent, we have Tori to tell us about Billings' biggest blood drive happening all of next week. So uh, what should folks know about this? So yeah, it's like you said, Billings' biggest blood drive. It is all next week, which is July 26th through the 30th, and it happens at our donation center at um, 144, 1444 Grand Avenue. And so it is just our opportunity to really get a lot of people out to come donate blood, help us with that summer blood supply. Um, historically, the summer blood supply is always a little low. Mm -hmm. People are out and about doing what they <laughs> want to do rather than scheduling blood donation. But of course, with the pandemic, we've seen it dip even lower this time. You know, people are now able to get out and about and do what they want to do. And so um, we're really asking people to give us that hour, <laughs> help yeah. us, help us make sure we have the blood on the shelves that we need to save those patients' lives. Mm -hmm. So you can make an appointment by going to vitalent.org, searching for the Billing Center, and there's plenty of times to fit you in all the way Monday through Friday next, Saturday next week. Mm -hmm. And if anyone's worried about, well, I got my COVID vaccine, am I still eligible to donate, are they? Yes, absolutely. Um, there's no waiting period, whether you're in the first dose, second dose, completed dose, any of those things, um, as long as it's through an approved vendor and we're really not seeing anybody not getting it through an approved vendor so it doesn't affect um, your blood donation at all if you're feeling well and healthy that day that's the question regardless of any day or any um, the vaccine or any medications or anything like that you might be taking so if you're able to answer that yes I feel well and healthy today you're able to donate blood. Mm -hmm. And from my personal experience, I've been able to donate a few times myself. Um, it's such a nice facility. Um, everyone's very welcoming, professional. They know what they're doing. Yes. So I know some people are afraid of needles, but oh, yeah. oh, I, was at, I was at ease when I was able to go in. And I also donated, um, was it platelets? Yeah. And, oh Great. my gosh, that was like a, a Cadillac. They set you up with a movie <laughs> and you got yep. the, the war packs on your arm so you don't get cold. And it is just an overall great experience. And yeah, I always like to tell donors, if you're nervous about any Anything, or if you have a fear of needles, um, something you maybe have even had a bad experience before. Of course, it wasn't with us, it was with somebody else. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but just let us know that because we will definitely make sure and and give you all the extra attention and call me down that you need. I have a friend who is really, really worried about donating blood. So they put the ice pack on her chest right off the bat just mm -hmm. to keep her nice and cool. And yeah. so it, it helps us if you tell us, you know, if you're right. a little nervous. But yes, very professional, very well qualified. We're going to do everything we can to put mm -hmm. you at ease and make sure you have a great experience. Yeah, my trick, I just always look away when they're yep. doing it. You, know, <laughs> you I don't, just, have, you I don't never have to look watch away. anything. We won't make <laughs> yeah, you. Exactly. <laughs> don't worry. <laughs> oh, well, thank you so much for joining us. I hope you guys have a great turnout for uh, yeah. Billings' biggest blood drive happening all next week on the Grand Avenue location. We'll be right back after this.